Hey everybody, how are you? This is Snake Diet Pete up here in beautiful God's Country, Montana. Um, I uh, I have gone through the process of the snake diet and uh, still continue to use it. And I lost 103 pounds in a little over six months. 287 now down to uh, 184. And um, I pretty much use the two meal a day protocol. And just want to give you an update. Uh, and when I say the two meal a day, or excuse me, the two meal a week protocol. So I would either uh, eat Wednesdays and Sundays or Fridays and Sundays. So I do a, a three day fast, eat, and then four day fast. Or I would do a five day fast and then eat two days later and do you know 48 hour fast. So Friday night, Sunday night, or uh, Wednesday night, Sunday night. Um, so how am I maintaining um, how am I maintaining my weight loss? So what I do primarily is I just do 48s now. So I just eat every other day. And that just maintains right where I am. I eat whatever I want, pretty much however much I want till I'm full. And I just never eat back-to-back -back days. Now, if I so happen, let's say I, I um, you know, ate a Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and I ate a ton or something. You know, I was away on a trip or whatever the case may be. Um, and I gained a few pounds. What what would I do, you know, to get back down to that level? I would just go back to my two meals a week, right? And usually within a week, all that is gone. And then some maybe, right? And then I go back to my maintenance. What's my maintenance? Every other day. Every other day. Now, there are some people that for their maintenance, they they eat, um, they eat every single day. And then every week or so, they throw in a three-day fast, right, to make up for the excessive caloric calories that you've been eating. But for me right now, um, eating every other day has worked as far as maintenance. It keeps it simple. Um, you know, it keeps it structured. And um, it just makes it really easy. And, you know, I really just don't think we need to be eating every day. I think having a day in between eating is a wonderful thing. I, I think that's such a blessing to, to all of us, you know, for, for not only maintaining the, you know, the body that you've developed and created and, you know, being super fit, but just all the incredible health reasons, right? Autophagy and uh, cell regeneration and um, organs, uh, great for your digestive system, uh, great for your immune system, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Just give yourself a break from eating every day. So, um, I'll give you an example. I did a um, oh a few weeks ago. I ate huge on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and ate most of the day on, on all three of those days. It was Easter weekend. It was Easter weekend a couple weeks ago, and I tell you what. I was so grateful to go into uh, an extended fast after that. You know, my body was like, please don't eat. <laughs> you know, um, that week I did, I ended up doing a five and a two, five day fast followed by a two day fast after eating those three huge you know, eating days. Um, and of course, when I did the five and a two, I lost all that, all that weight. So um, it's going fantastic. The snake diet is just a lifestyle. Eating every other day and maintenance now is a lifestyle. And, you know, a lot of people ask, well, why did I end up doing kind of the aggressive protocol of two meals a week? You know, what was the reason for that? Because I, the reason I did that, guys, is I wanted to get it over with, right? I wanted to, to lose that 100 pounds really quickly. I, you know, I didn't want to do just OMAD or, you know, um, just eat every other day, 48, which I'm doing now to maintain, because I don't think those are good weight loss protocols. I think they're very slow and sometimes you don't lose anything at all. Um, if I'm going to do something, let's get to that goal weight 
Uh, let's get to that goal weight as quick as we can, right? Then we can start enjoying ourselves a little more and eating it for me every other day. That's what I want. I didn't, you know, I wouldn't say doing five day fast is fun. It's not. It's not. It's not terrible. Um, but, you know, I want to get through that as fast as I can. Why? Why not lose the 100 pounds in six months as opposed to losing 100 pounds in two years? Why, why, why extend that? Get it done and then go into a maintenance mode, whatever the maintenance mode is for you. Some people's maintenance may be, um, some people's maintenance may be a, a real small meal every night, OMAD, you know. Uh, mine is eating every other day and I don't have to worry about counting calories or doing anything like that. Other people may be eating every day and throwing in a three-day, a 72-hour fast every week or every week and a half, right? So it's it's totally up to the person. But why not get to where you want to go? And then, um, and then you can go into maintenance and start eating more frequently, which is great. The other thing that I recommend, guys, is if you have a goal weight, and, and Cole talks about this all the time, if, if you have a goal weight, I found it very helpful to go even 10 pounds below what your goal weight was. As Cole calls it, you know, get bone thin. Because we know when we eat, when we have that huge meal, at least, you know, it's in Cole's case, and I know in my case, uh, if I've been fasting for uh, 72, 96 hours, uh, 120 hours, um, when I have that huge meal, the next morning when I wake up, um, you know, I'm 10 pounds heavier than I was before, you know, when I weighed in before I ate that huge meal. Because you tend to gain, I, I found you tend to gain about 8 to 12 pounds when you have that enormous meal after fasting for 3 to 5 days. Um, so I always say go under your goal weight. So if you want to be, I'm just making this up, if someone wants to be 200 pounds, they should get down to 190 because you're going to be fluctuating. Right, you're going to be fluctuating. It gives you some more wiggle room, doesn't it? It gives you some more wiggle room. So everything's going fantastic. I love it. I'm coaching students uh, from all over the globe on the snake diet, and uh, I've got a phenomenal coaching program. If you guys are interested in in having a coach, um, a paid coach to help guide you and be able to talk to every single day, I'm telling you, it makes all the difference in the world. Same reason why you know Cole does his coaching. Um, it's investing yourself. It's worth the money. It's, um, you know, being going at this alone is very, very difficult. And it's great to have someone like myself that's walked the talk, right? That's done it. That's uh, had immense success very quickly. So reach out to me. Um, you know, you can uh, either call me or send me an email. Send me a message there on YouTube. Uh, or wherever you see this video, okay? If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. Um, please feel free to comment. Let me know how your snake diet journey is going and um, any questions you might have. And um, uh, and please share. If you if you feel this, is, this video has brought value to others and could be valuable to others uh, on their weight loss journey, please share it. I certainly would appreciate that. And uh, I appreciate you guys, all my snake diet followers. And um, guys, believe me, it's worth it, man. Stick with it. Follow it. Be disciplined. You know, when I ate two meals a week for that 60 months, or 60 months, six months, um, you know, sometimes it sucked. But the key was staying busy. And always when I wanted to eat, I just put in my mind, you know, I wanted to have that body, you know, for the beach to look so good when, you know, I call it the, the turn the head body. You know, when you walk down the beach and everyone's head turns, that's what I got. And, and, um, and you got to have a big why. Whatever that why is for you, make sure you have a big why. God bless you guys. Talk to you real soon. Bye-bye.